Hi, I'd like to welcome you to MBA 500. My name is Jeff Rowine, and this is just a short introductory video to get you rolling in this course. Uh, number one, I'd like to congratulate you on starting your MBA. It's a great investment in yourself, uh, your, your time and energy and effort you put into this course and, and then all the subsequent courses is invaluable to you to add skills, knowledge, um, perspective, a whole host of things that are positive for you in your career and your, your goals for yourself as you move ahead. Um, the course is uh, set up to be fairly straightforward. Um, and this specifically, the goals of this course are to prepare you in a couple critical areas or to evaluate you first and then prepare you a little more in a couple critical areas. And that is in writing. So you write at a graduate level. Um, using Excel as a tool for much of your coursework and also just for self-management. There's some things in here for you that should be uh, invaluable in that sense. Um, so let's just look at it. Uh, if you go down the left-hand column, you can see announcements, syllabus, assignments, grades, so on and so forth. I, I would encourage you to click on all of these to look around to see what's available to you. And it won't look exactly like this because this is my view of this course, which is a different view than you, obviously, as a student. Um, but the first thing you want to do, I'm just going to click on, and you've got, you know, links here. Um, there's your link to the syllabus, and then I click to let's get started. I'm just going to take you to assignments just to show you the layout of the course. And this is sort of the order I would suggest you do these in is to start with academic success tools. There's directions under each of these. You just click here, research resources, editing and writing tools, time management. Um, all of these are valuable to you. Otherwise, we wouldn't put them in there. Um, and maybe some more so than others, depending upon your strengths and, and weaknesses as a student. But do, do take that seriously. Just work your way through it. Take you maybe a half hour to go through all of those at the most. But they, they are tools and perspectives that you can use throughout your MBA uh, academic pursuits and your coursework here at Midland. So they're really important kind of a uh, gateway. The next thing I would suggest you do is the writing test. Read the directions carefully, as it says. Um, do your very best. If you score high enough, and I, I'll leave that for you to read the directions, this will... Um, remove you from the need to do the rest of the writing assignments, which they, you see listed below here. So you really put some effort into that writing test. Okay, the next thing that you'll want to complete then is uh, the Excel course, or the Excel, um, there's a pre-test or a test and evaluation. Again, if you score high enough, you won't have to take the rest of the Excel work. Uh, but if you do either one, the writing test and you don't score high enough or the Excel modeling course, um, don't think of that as a failure, but really that's there to help you. It's an assessment to say you, you need some extra help in these areas. So as you will succeed in your coursework and the investment in getting your MBA. So don't look at it as a negative. It's really more, you know, if you got a temperature, your doctor might say, you know, you need a, a pill or a penicillin or something to make you feel better. You want to take the corrective action that's that's available to you and help you out. So um, I think that pretty much sums up. I'm not going to go into a lot of detail because you'll you'll be able to to go through this as uh, as you should. The last thing I would recommend to you is pay attention to the due dates. There are due dates in here uh, that are important, uh, but so as not to make due dates a problem, start now. Just sit down and work your way through this as, you know, not to just get it done, but to, to complete it in a satisfactory um, manner. And it, there is some time involved, especially when you work through the Excel modeling course, if that's part of, part of the bargain. Uh, but it's all going to serve you very well when you get into the coursework that uh, deals with those tools. So don't procrastinate. Work through this. Get it done. And I think you'll find it enjoyable and valuable both at the same time. If you have questions, let me know. My, my contact information is in the course. 
and I'll do the best I can to help you. But um, again, congratulations. Great to meet you and go get them.